All right, so I'm in my car and it says map card here. I'm gonna put it inside the map card right here. Let's see. Okay, yank this little thing. And now there's no chip in there. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull this little chip thing in here. And I am gonna put it in like that. Straight in there, you see? Okay, it's in there. Okay, it's in there, you see? And I'm gonna... Okay, I feel the click. All right. We're gonna try it out. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. <clears throat> Press the caution, never drive, and be on your phone at the same time. This is audio. Let's see. All right, all right, all right. Downloading, please wait. That sounds good. That's a good sign. Unable to read the map SD. Check map SD if necessary. Consult your dealer. But that's not good. Let me see. Unable to read chip, okay. A contact history, okay. Let me see. Let me turn it off. And turn it back on. Loading map. I don't know if that's good. Oh, still not working. So I will have to end this video and figure out the setup and then get back. So unfortunately the SD card that I purchased for the Tundra for the navigation system update uh, did not work. I had uh, emailed the, the seller on eBay and they told me that uh, it does fit this vehicle. It's probably defected and they're going to send one. But I had already requested a, a uh, return. So I will probably, I don't need it. I just want it to function on my vehicle I use my phone but I probably in the next few weeks I'm just gonna buy another one and I'll make another video of that yeah so make sure I don't know I guess make sure you buy it from a reputable seller or somebody that's like I guess everybody's having good luck with on Amazon so probably try to buy it on Amazon or uh, somewhere the dealer if you don't want it to have issues.